What is going on guys? Thanks again for joining me for another video. So what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be leveling our lawn a little bit here. So um, with it being prime time growth season, it is May the 15th right now. So we're just gonna fill in a little bit of these low spots here just to build it up over time. Typically when you wanna add soil to your yard, you do it right at the prime time of growing season, which that's right where we're in now. So right in the middle of May, everything's gonna really start to be shooting up. So what we're going to be using here, we're going to be using the lawn leveling tool, which is great. It can even out all those bumps. And then right here, this is a groundskeeper two rake, which is awesome with getting little rocks out and just a couple of little things. I'll show you guys, um, you know, how good it really works. And then this thing right here, this is a gorilla cart, way better than a wheelbarrow. Um, you can load anything in here, whether it's soil, dirt, flowers, mulch, anything. It's gonna save your back these are about a hundred dollars at Lowe's but they are sweet and then as far as what we're using this is just a screened loom and I mix in uh, some mason sand with it so it's about an 80 20 mix but it's gonna give it a nice firm uh, leveling if you just use loom that can kind of deteriorate over time so we're gonna go ahead and use a little bit of sand in there just to make it nice and firm um, like I told you guys in my earlier videos, I bought this house in uh, 2018, December, and it was a mess out here. So I did this last September. I did the same exact process with a little bit of sand, a little bit of topsoil. Um, I got the screen loom. I just got it from a garden store that I, I got. It was about $25 a yard. So uh, it's a good deal. So we're going to go ahead and fill out all this, get it nice and even, and then we'll come back again. We'll do this in September, but it's, you just want to build this up over time. So uh, we're going to do the first part here in May and let's see how we do it. We just did about a half inch of loom. That's a good amount to just do at this time. There's no need to reseed any of this. So this is all, this is gonna grow right through here, which is perfect. So that's exactly what you wanna do. Um, if you have a really bumpy lawn, like I said, it's good to do this twice a year. So you just build it up a little bit over time and then eventually you get it real flat. So that's about it. We'll move on to the next one. All right guys, so that's gonna go ahead and do it for the video. So this is just my version of leveling a lawn. I had awesome results when I did this last September. And I'm sure if you guys do it the same way, you're gonna have great results yourself. So 
This is just my version of doing it. I like to add just a little bit of loom over time just to get a more level lawn and you know to add some nutrients to the lawn before I start just throwing sand all over the place. So eventually I will do that and there's a bunch of different ways that you can level your lawn. This is just my version of it just because again I had great results doing it. So we got a couple of things coming up here in the next couple of weeks. We're going to be putting down our second application of pre-emergent. So we will be putting that down this week. And we're also going to be talking about lawn diseases, common lawn diseases that you'll get in your, uh, in your lawn in the summer. So um, again, that's basically going to do it for the video. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. And again, truly do appreciate you guys watching my videos. It's awesome support, great community. You guys are awesome. Uh, but again, that's going to go ahead and do it. You guys have yourself a great rest of the weekend.